This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment and educational purposes only. And anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff so you get the videos I put them out. See what I'm thinking, see man analyzing that data. But like I tell every day, the day they release us is false. Man, it gives a false narrative of the market so we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, the bad actors are still doubling and tripling down on AMC. They were able to push it down under $3 yesterday. But you know what? It bounced right back because when it goes down, retail investors, institutions start buying it up. And these bad actors don't even know what they're going to do at this point. As far as I'm concerned, and this is just my opinion, I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell any stock. But I think they have sold so many counterfeit AMC shares that all retail investors and institutions who are long have to do is just sit down and watch. And a whole house of cards will come tumbling down. Okay, I really don't believe we have to do anything else but just to sit on the sidelines and just watch the whole thing implode on itself. That's just my opinion. And once again, I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell AMC. I'm just telling you that I believe that's how many counterfeit AMC shares they have created and sold into the market in order to manipulate the price. Anyway, here are the numbers. The volume yesterday, 31,320,932. That's like 25% greater than the day before, which tells me that they're getting desperate. They're doing everything in their power to, <laughs> to get those counterfeit shares in there to manipulate the price of AMC. And guess what? Calls in the money, 36930 At $4, 57682 Now, you guys know that I don't think these call options mean absolutely nothing, I believe that it benefits the short-term calls the weekly calls i believe this benefits the the bad actors that's just my opinion i believe they use it to generate cash to help with their liquidity but you got to do what your dd tells you to do but here's the thing 56.1 percent of the volume was shorted shares so somehow yesterday they found 18 million counterfeit amc shares to short where did these shares come from? AMC, SEC, FBI, DOJ. Where did they find 18 million AMC shares to short into the market? Will we ever see the blue sheets? Will we see the chain of custody? Will we see where these shares originated? Of course not. Of course not. But that's how they manipulate the price. But the thing is, we keep buying and they're stuck. And they're stuck. And here's the crazy part. They added double the amount of shorts from the day before. The day before, they had 9 million new short positions. Now they doubled that. They added 18 million new short positions. And guess what? The days to cover went down. How are you doubling? You didn't cover the shorts from the day before. You're doubling the shorts today. Doubling it from 9 million to 18 million. But your days to cover go down? Yo, this makes absolutely no sense logically, no sense mathematically. And, yo, these guys are just criminals. They're just criminals. That's really the bottom line. And our regulatory agencies know it. Our law enforcement agency know it. But somehow their hands are tied and they're allowing the biggest financial crime in the history of the planet to continue on their watch. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. How do you double the short positions from the day before, yet the days to cover goes down? Anyway, have a great day. God bless, and I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.